supporters of Saple Okbe community in Saple local government area of Delta State has hosted the grand finale of the ongoing Urapele Ame annual masquerade dance festival in Saple Town. For three market days, Saple Town has been bubbling as the other three quarters that makes up the community, namely Eborode, Uton, and Etama quarters, are taking turns to celebrate the festival with Udumo Godo climaxing the event on the fourth market day. The Urapele Ame annual masquerade festival is one of the signa of the Saple Okbe community and an identity is sort of for them. The festival is one that showcases the rich and enviable culture of the Okbe people and in continuing in its rich heritage, the Saple Okbe community chairman Okakuro Onorode Timiagi has decided to host this year's event that has seen guests and Okbe sons and daughters from different parts of the world come together to celebrate. Grand finale started with a march from Amuogodo area down to community playground along Labod Road as Domogodo quarters danced and celebrated the events. Leading interviews before other top guests spoke, Saple Okbe community chairman Okakuro Temiagi highlighted the importance of the festival, revealing that it is to showcase the Okbe culture and also to thank the gods for peace and prosperity in the land. I am Okakuro, Onoriode, Emmanuel, Temiagi, Dokobe, Ofotoku Ujigare, of Sapele Okbe community. Currently, I'm the chairman of this community. The significance of this festival, those, our ancestors who founded this land, the significance is for peace, progress, and prosperity for the town. So this festival, heralding it, the women folk, we call them a Mercy old people they had to cleanse the town to the river cleansing means evil from the land criminals from the land kidnappers from the land hired assassins from the land this was done before the celebration started on the uh, 27th of march and today we are in the grand finale is for peace that's the significance and any evil in the town is gone if you noticed in the night there was a storm from around 1 a.m. till this early morning signifying cleansing acceptance of whatever we have done all have gone my name is chief engineer john a utokwefo jp a representative of the roji we are much impressed in fact all this has come to new life most of our children never knew or know what about Uriabinamek is, but today with the present generation, they can see that we have certain things that protect and project the image of Okwe. And like what my the one of the children that the man in charge here said, before the white man came to Okwe here, we have certain things that protect the integrity of the Okwe people. And these are some of the arrowhead. Are you know the arrowhead? Head. Like Rebele Ame, we see what has done in the past. There was a particular time in Sabla here when certain things are not fulfilled. There was a total, you know, destruction here. And when the the gods, the Sabla Ame was appeased, there was total, you know, stability in the in the place. So I pray that those who think about it. Think about the cultural heritage, what we've forgotten before, that we are bringing to nine light, that you continue to revive it. So the unborn children, born and unborn children, will understand that the Okbe, Okbe, as a tribe in Robo, Okbe nation in Robo language, in Robo land, is a very prosperous one. My name is Okakuro Moses. Abeke Babuba, a retired Lieutenant Colonel. My father is from Oton, my mother is from Ambogodo. So I'm like a dog, I'm here, I'm here. The festival 
it's for peace, it's for progress, it's for prosperity and uh, joy for us to celebrate. Everybody does it. Everybody does it. It's a carnival for us to recognize our ancestors, our great grandfathers, uh, so that our deities will not lose. That is the essence of this uh, celebration. Companies should come so that our brothers and sisters can get job to do, so that the town can progress. Uh, you know when you clinch a place, a, a town, progress normally comes, isn't it? That is what we are after. I'm Chief Tom Anera. It's, it's an annual celebration and uh, it is a very firm belief that uh, um, the festival of Rapalame ushers in the goddess of peace, the goddess from the waters that brings peace and prosperity to the community, to the inhabitants of the town, and uh, all and sundry. My name is Ashif Cyril Abeyogoda. Today event is the first, it's our yearly event. In other climes, we can say today is our new year. Ah, it's a festival of peace that we celebrate every year. The Rapalame Festival is a fe uh, festival of peace to show usher in peace, to usher in tranquility, progress, to usher in good health. That is what we are doing. That is the significance of what we are doing today. As we are doing this one, we are coming. I'm sure you followed us uh, from Mudumo Godo. Uh -huh. I'm sure you followed us to where we are praying for people of this time. Pray for everybody. We pray even for the non-natives. For them to progress in this time. For there to be peace. For there to be tranquility in the whole of Sapele. That is the significance of what we are doing today. Honorable Moses Ogoda is my name. I'm happy that we, the Sapele people, are bringing back our heritage by celebrating what our ancestors used to do for the betterment of Sapele. Traditionally, when we, our forefathers, who happen to be believers of Rapalame, they do it to cleanse the town, cleanse the town against evil forces, bad things, sicknesses, and war, and bring in prosperity. You understand? And that is what we are benefiting from it. I am particularly very, very happy seeing the Sapele Ogbe community uh, celebrating the Oriapelame today. It brings uh, to mind that uh, over the years, there are things traditionally uh, people have neglected or, you know, tried, forgotten. Uh, culturally, these are things our forefathers, you know, keep doing that fosters unity and, you know, it's a way of promotion, uh, promoting the culture amongst the, 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 the people of the place. So I'm very happy seeing them, you know, coming up with this celebration today. My name is Ezekiel Washi Ogodo. I'm the youth chairman of Duma Ogodo Quarter. Okay, to the people of uh, Sapel and to the people of Okbe at large, this festival is for fruitfulness, protection, and for more to usher peace and unity to the land. Uh, the festival dated back a long, a long time ago when they brought the festival to Sapele and up to now you can see us showcasing the rich cultural heritage of our people. Pray for peace, more blessings to return to Sapele, unity and oneness for all uh, Okmes and non-indigenous, non-native and uh, people in diaspora and uh, all over uh, the whole universe who are praying that peace and oneness should return back to the world, not Sapele alone. Lame. So they did. I thank God, I thank Raplame for the program of today. So I don't have much more to say. I just give thanks to God, give thanks to Raplame. And today, everything that we are doing successfully, thank God, I thank Raplame for 
celebration that we are celebrating today. Message to my children. I give thanks to God that I should bless my children after the festival. Also with the people of this Sapele, the four quarters. May the God of Raplame bless all of them. Those that are even come to come and follow us to celebrate. I pray that Raplame should bless all of them. All their desire, Raplame should give it to them. So that the next year that we will do the celebration again, they will come and give thanks to Raplame. I am. Akbarero Henry Akwos, and this is Rero TV. Thank you for watching.